the age of 30, immunologist Andrea Aplasser has already achieved what many scientists only dream of. Last year, she made a breakthrough in her field and published her findings in major scientific journals. Now she's been honored with the Paul Ehrlich and Ludwig Darmstädter Prize for young medical researchers. Ultimately, I'm pleased at the results that brought me the prize, the achievement that led to it. And it's a great feeling to get this recognition for my achievement. Aplasser has been working at the University of Bonn since 2008. She discovered her love for medical research while still a student. Originally, she wanted to work on cancer, but then she began to research the immune system. Her fascination with the field has continued to grow. At Bonn University Hospital, pure research is closely linked to day-to-day -day medical practice. So Aplasser can work with specimens from patients and test her hypotheses against clinical symptoms. She says a lot has happened in the past few years to make Germany more attractive to research scientists. I think that as far as training for young scientists is concerned, Germany is in the process of changing. I think German universities and the business community have recognized how important it is to support young scientists in their career planning to point the way to career opportunities. Aplasser is investigating how the immune system recognizes viruses and bacteria and then targets them. She's discovered new receptors and messenger molecules that communicate threats to neighboring cells. That helps trigger a rapid immune response. You could compare what we're doing to industrial espionage in a way. We want to find out how these mechanisms work in nature, which will hopefully allow us to use them in a treatment framework. She'll leave Bonn soon to take up a post at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Lausanne. As an assistant professor there, she'll set up her own research team. On the one hand, I'm looking forward to it. On the other, I'm a little in awe. It's a different kind of responsibility, but of course I'm glad. It will be an exciting time. Keeps life interesting. In Lausanne, Aplasser plans to investigate how the immune system works within individual cells, an area where there are still many unanswered questions. Maybe one day she'll make another groundbreaking discovery.